Hello everyone, this is Angela from AngelaMcCall.com. Today I'm going to show you a different way of making your background transparent by creating a silhouette. Like for instance, on this rose, I can create a silhouette on this object and make the background transparent. In the previous video, we did this logo, Apple logo, and all I did was got into my um, eraser tool and um, select magic eraser tool and I just click that background and it gives me this checkered background which means it is transparent I didn't have to do anything I didn't have to select the the Apple logo is the way it is because the logo is very very nice and clean and so um, that's one good thing about having this type of um, illustration because the image is just ready to go however on this let's say we have a different background and this is very you know hard if I go to my magic eraser tool for instance look it doesn't really do much you can see that it just select a certain part of this because the background has different colors and it just picking up all the colors that I um, I actually made a silhouette on this rose before I show you it's it takes a while to create a uh, silhouette on this I use this pen tool it's my favorite tool in Photoshop to make a silhouette and I have created a silhouette on this and if I go on my paths select my path and down click the circle broken circle and it gives me this selection right when I say select part of this around all of these objects that I wanted to be transferred to another background is being selected that's what I meant select so I can actually um, copy this okay copy and go to a different background and paste it and see I've got a different background now I have a white background now if I go to my layers and say this white background is not transparent okay so when you see it white like that it means it's not transparent but I go to my magic eraser tool and click the background and look it it looks checkered the background is transparent when you see the checkered background so that's what I meant of creating a, a silhouette object and making the background transparent this is another way of doing it now say you didn't want that background transparent you want to put it in a different background say you're creating a uh, a Christmas card or some sort of card and I want to put that rose on this background paste it and you can actually um, dramatize this create a two different rows and it gives you a different background and a different layout so this is what I've been saying that yes you can make a different background out of your object by using pen tool anyway I hope you learned today how to make a different background and thank you for watching and I'll see you later goodbye